2K Sports, in association with the PGA Tour, is proud to bring you the final stop of the FedEx Cup playoffs. Today's coverage of the Tour Championship is about to start. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. Luke Elby alongside Rich Beam, and Rich, this player's been playing some impressive golf. They've got the lead, they're where they want to be, but what should be their mindset going into this round? Well, hopefully it's not on the chasing pack because the chasing pack is filled with some big names. So they're going to have to really bear down, focus on to the task at hand. They've got to sit there and keep their emotions to themselves and not get wrapped up in everybody else around them. Well, I'm looking forward to today, that's for sure. Let's see what kind of Tony sets for himself today. Oh, absolutely flushed. And what are we looking at here, Henny? Setting up here from about 155. This is looking pretty good in the air. Well, that's a lovely approach and sets up a birdie opportunity here at the first. Just three feet to go to the hole. Don't miss this. They can be costly. Just building upon his advantage, he keeps making the important plays. And that should calm whatever nerves his player has. Nice opening hole. And a quick glimpse of the leaderboard, and they're currently first, with Justin Thomas second. to be going with the five iron. <laughs> Pay attention, folks. That's how you play golf. This putt coming up is for birdie. I like the look of this. And down it goes. So that's back-to-back -back birdies. That's a momentum maker, isn't it? Back-to-back -back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Here's some action from just a short time ago. And what an approach this is. That's an absolute peach. Well played. So after that effort, this is the current standings on the course. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. No harm, no foul there with that shot. Oh, that's a high caliber shot. Oh, a nine foot chance here. This is what they have left for Birdie here. Oh, I don't mind this par putt. In she goes. Let's head to the next. Well, it's a great view on the leaderboard. Sitting in top spot, but Justin Thomas is second. Teeing off here at the fourth. And Henny, what's he looking at here? 
setting up here from about 175 yards. Looks to have chosen the seven iron. They've decided to club up. And here we are with the third shot. Well, that should limit the damage. Nicely done. Why not take another look at that effort? I need to see this again because I still can't believe they hold that. Well, that's a phenomenal performance. The lead is now out to 10 shots. Incredible. It's time to step onto the tee here at the fifth. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? He's got roughly 105 yards here. Yep, give yourself a pat on the back. What's in front of them, Henny, with this putt? Setting up this putt 14 feet from the cup. This for back-to-back -back birdies. It's on a great line. Just didn't drop. And the putt drops, and we're moving on. Our leader is currently enjoying an eight-shot advantage. Let's see what happens here on the sixth. You don't need to be long off the tee, Luke. It's only 525 yards, but the second shot plays straight back up the hill, so a little length helps. You like that, didn't you? What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? You're going to need one or two clubs more because this green is sitting up. Great looking shot, this. That was a beauty right against the hole. Well, that certainly makes putting a lot easier when you can hit a shot like that. Here's Ricky Fowler from earlier. Look at the shot that this player possesses. Yes! Okay, let's get back to the action. Nine feet to the cup. Their boldness paid off. They've got this for the eagle. Yep, tracking nicely. Oh, how about that one? leading by nine strokes after that one. Let's see what happens here on the seventh.
Then Henny, what are you seeing down there? And from around 135 yards. Looks to have opted for the eight iron. Oh, this one's right down the pipe. What a shot. Almost went in the bucket. A wonderful shot and a chance for Purdy here at the seventh. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. Nice one. Fourth booty of the day. And maintaining top spot on the leaderboard after that. Now on the tee after a birdie. Fired up and ready for more. Oh, that is crushed. Where will this one end up? That's some good golf right there. This shot coming from around the 150-yard marker. Nicely done. What are we looking at for this putt, Henny? They've just got to focus on hitting the back of the cup, guys. This is up the hill, bit of extra juice needed. Surely it's going to. And racking up their fifth booty of the day. Two in a row there, Luke, getting their groove on. And just keeping it in neutral on the leaderboard. And now striding onto the tee of this par three hole. Opting for the hybrid, I think. A oh, lovely looking shot into birdie range here at the ninth. Oh, yeah, this is tracking nicely. And that will drop in for birdie. This player must be in heaven. Their lead is now 11. We've reached the beginning of the back nine, the 10th. That's a nice looking tee shot, that one. And Henny, what kind of a shot are they facing this time? Well, I wouldn't mind hitting the shot, but I wouldn't fancy the walk up here. This is quite uphill. That's an absolute ripper. What a shot. This one's for Birdie.
Look at him just surging ahead at the top of the leaderboard. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. We have a par three on this one. Opting for the five iron. This looks to be hit pretty well from where I'm standing. Well, got some sort of streak going on here. Greens in regulation. What a statistic. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. The putt is underway. And that's eight birdies today. And a quick glimpse of the leaderboard. And they're currently first with Justin Thomas second. Let's head to the 12th hole. <laughs> Lovely effort, that. John, give us an update. What's shaking? Hey guys, we are checking in with Ricky Fowler as he gets set for his next shot here on the 13th. Time for the second shot at the 12th. Not bad. A birdie putter waits. Yep, tracking well. He's making this look easy. Keeps surging ahead. Currently in first position. Two great shots are required here because this hole is a long par four. This looks to be heading for the cut stuff. <laughs> Playing this shot from 120 yards. And choosing the eight iron here. That one should find the surface. Left yourself an opportunity. And this putt is for birdie three on the scorecard. Okay, steady now. No, that's too bad. Pretty straightforward four-footer coming up here. Looking good. And in it goes for the par. An extraordinary performance. This player is now 12 strokes in front of the field. And now teeing off on this par four hole. Mm -hmm. A thing of beauty. <laughs> Playing this shot from around 220 yards here.
Going with the five iron here. Pretty good shot there. Henny, you've had the chance to have a look over this one. Uh, 18 footer here is what he's facing. Little birdie look in here. Big chance here. Oh, what a super shot. So no change on the leaderboard for this player after that hole. Teeing off here at the 15th hole. This one's got eyes for the flag stick. Terrific shot into the 15th and a chance for birdie. Full of confidence as well with their putter. Gotta like their chances. Nice line. And down she goes. Back to back birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Let's go to our man John on the ground. There's something brewing down there. Let's find out what it is. Hey guys, we're checking in down here with Brooke Henderson as she gets set for her next shot here on the 18th. Oh my, that shot's gonna count as that saves the par on the final hole. Well played. And after that effort, this is how the field is shaping up. Looking to ride the momentum after coming off a birdie here with this shot.
This shot from 120 yards. Going with the eight iron here. Should find the green here. Mm. That's right out of the copy books. Exquisite. Luke, nothing gets past you. Yes, this kid is a stud. Well, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. Good stuff today, especially the short game has been really sharp today. Fair effort, that. Good birdie. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. Always positive coming off a birdie. Let's see what happens here. Uh-oh, we're starting to hear roars from another part of the course. That was wonderfully done. Let's head to the last hole for this wonderful highlight. Fantastic touch on this one. Pretty straightforward shot, about what you'd expect to see from this player. Okay, let's get back to it, shall we? This one looks to be on a pretty good line. That one just slides by. A wonderful shot here at the 17th and a chance for birdie. That's tracking. Well played. Well, it's a great view on the leaderboard. Sitting in top spot, but Justin Thomas is second. One more hole to go. The 18. <laughs> Nicely done. Going with the hybrid. That's well played. Pin high. What's in front of them, Henny? Yeah, they've left it in the perfect spot here, just below the hole. They can be aggressive up the hill. What a putt. Started this perfectly. And another round safely in the books.